Hi guys, it's Men here from the Fruit Gang, and welcome back to part 9 of Fallout 4. And yeah, we, we're again joined by Coconut. Hi! So yeah, we're just gonna. Yeah, we got here in last episode. Um, There was this guard here, and I said, could we just kill him so we could steal all the stuff, but he seemed to have wandered off somewhere, so close all the doors quickly. Make sure no one sees us, because we're gonna. We haven't got any bobby pins, so. Wait, do you think the glitch will work on this? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Let's go on to the terminal. Like oh, this one. Okay, so it could be this. Like this two. Okay. It could be that. No, no, I can't. It's not spiders. It. It's not pipes anymore. No. It's. It's probably wait, wait, wait. It's probably ideas. Yeah. No. Oh. Oh. About. Oh, if you no 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 wait. Don't 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 use one sec. Look, they have like little combinations. Like go down. They on the terminals. They have like combinations. See look. Yeah. If you go back look to the left, to the left. Hmm. And like to the right or something. You can get like secret ones. They're like multiples long. You know? You'll see, you'll see what I'm... Like, go to the top and, and it, like, it, like, resets your numbers if you... Like, just keep going across. Uh, it will, like, reset your numbers. No down, down one line. What, do I have to do this, like, yeah, you like, did? But they, it might be, like, a long... Yeah. There we go, look. Back, back, back. Look. Doug removed, it got rid of one of the fakes. So now I'll keep going. Keep doing it. Doug removed. It gets rid of all the ones that it isn't. You can and then you like, keep going down. It's a little trick that I learned. They have like secret little codes. I never actually knew this. I used to play Fallout 3 a lot. So this might have been in Fallout 3. Yeah, it was definitely. They like it just and also it can reset your tries. So keep trying to find one until it resets your try. I know it's gonna take a little while while but it's worth it kind of thing. Because yeah. we can upload it like in the video Yep. I've got three hours for the moment. Look, okay. Tries yeah, reset. Tries reset, there you go. Now you can try again. Don't, no, no, don't use any more. Because it might be another tries reset and then you've just wasted one. Alright, so, um, should we go for teams? It's up to you, yeah. And there's one. Okay, so it's heals, which is like it's two. So, I'd say it might be size. You think? No, no, no. Two of the letters are heals, though. It might be hides. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. There we go. Sorry. I bet there's nothing gone here though. Come on, baby, just. All of that, just with like notes. Wait, what was that? Safe control. Actually. Oh! Disengage lock. That was worth it, actually. That was worth that three minutes that we spent on this. See, guys, there's another little trick in this video. <laughs> How. Like a. Ooh. Kellogg's house. That could be useful. Oh yeah, look, there's loads of like ammo as well. Pre war plated yeah, flip flight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that was useful. See, guys, little trick for you. Um, basically, you need to find secret ones and they can, re they can get rid of the fake ones that it isn't. So. There's nothing in there we really need. But it unlocked all oh. of them. There's actually somebody in here. We're just like sneaking around, there's actually somebody in there. What the hell? Giddy up buttercup. <laughs> what the hell is that? Storming a giddy up buttercup. You're so naughty. Yay! Well, there was something in that cabinet. Uh, like, turn the radio on. Turn the TV on. That jam though. <laughs> okay, look, there's a to the right, to the right. We have to go in the elevator. We need to actually go into Diamond City now. 
Wait, you found the radio. So This could be like fall this is gonna be like Fallout Fortnite because we've uploaded like three videos of Fallout Fortnite. I might do a fourth one. <laughs> Why is it lagging? <laughs> Don't lag for me. Stick elevator jam. Can I kill dog meat? <laughs> he's, he's invincible, don't worry about him. You can actually shoot him so much that he, like, he needs a stim pack or else he dies. Really? I thought it was. Somebody told me he's invincible. Just open the gate. And we're going into Diamond City, guys. That's a. Oh, it's Codsworth. <laughs> I will get you. I will get you, my crow. I will get you. What is? He's got a hot dog. Oh, no. Ain't a hot dog. <laughs> what is that? Nim 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 nim. We probably look pretty weird, like running around in Diamond City with an axe. So we should probably put that away. <laughs> Who's this person? Free paper to newcomers. Free paper. Did you grab you in the night? Uh huh. Thanks. I get. <laughs> serious. The institute. I, I believe you. Thanks. You are a real. I have no idea how much then, Mister. Caps we so have. What are you doing in Diamond City anyway? None of your business. <laughs> Don't mind answer. Mind your own business. Oh, yeah, mind sorry your own business. For asking. Jeez. Nah. You gonna tell? How many ball caps do we actually have? Because there's shops around here. 165. Okay. Not too many, but we could buy some stuff there. All the shops are closed anyway. Uh, where do we. I think we need to go to Piper's office anyway. Which I have no idea where that is. Is this it? Nope. Is this it? Wait. We need the key. Nope. Everyone else may be closed, but Diamond City surplus is open 24 hours a day. Well, the place is not really open. Sure. I guess. Take a look. Let's take a look at what we have. We could use some bobby pins, actually. Yeah, they're actually really useful. 24 caps for eight. I'll probably just buy like five. 15 caps. Bone sword, I don't think we're gonna need that. <laughs> How much do you have? Hundred well we got hundred and fifty now. I want that. You should buy a gun and some ammo for it, like quite a lot of ammo. I don't think he's got any good guns though. No you have um some like pipe Also you should buy some um stim packs. They're really useful for like eleven. No, no, that's, that's one a for a hundred. No, no. <laughs> that is just overpriced. One for a hundred and fifty bottle caps. Wastelander's chest piece. Well, hundred, one thousand one hundred eighty. Oh, he's got nothing. We need. We 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 didn't even need those bobby pins. We could probably find some. He overprices these. Um. Sorry. You know what you're looking for? We have right. Wait. So, I need to go to Piper's office to data. Go to Piper's office. So, we'll put down. We'll, we'll get rid of this for now. It's over here. Okay. Right, here it is. Piper's office. Glad you dropped by. Hey, Piper. Hey, Piper. Holding up, Blue? Blue? Why are you calling me that? Because of the blue jumpsuit you're wearing? You're a vault dweller. So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. 
I'll come with you. Watch your back while you I need someone get used to replace to the world dog meat. <laughs> cool. He can glitch you out some. Uh, do you right, interview? Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? We were frozen. <laughs> My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. Wait. <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yes. Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The man out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Gives me hope, I guess. Honestly, seeing everyone <laughs> surviving out here, rebuilding the world, it gives me hope. That's surprisingly inspired, Blue. We're definitely quoting that. Now, the uh, big question. Why come to Diamond City? You're looking for someone, aren't you? She, she just Who knows it. it. <laughs> Sean. My son, Sean, was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. Yeah, but by now, by the time we find him, by the time we find him, by the time we, we find him, we'll probably be like 90. <laughs> Do you suspect the Institute's involved? You're so old, Dad. They might be. Sure sounds like they might be. Not even a baby is safe from I don't even know what the Institute is. And people wonder why I can't just look the other way. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Don't lose hope. No matter how much you want to give up, don't. You have to have hope that you'll see them again. Or at least that you'll know the truth. I just, I didn't do anything to him. <laughs> That's everything. Yep. It's gonna take I like some the things that they start with, so. I, think I just sounded like a skull. Diamond City plenty to talk about. Change Look, them. about your son. I didn't know if you were on the up and up before. Didn't want to waste my friend's time, but I think he can help you. His name's Nick Valentine. Nick Valentine. Detective extraordinaire. Got an office here in Diamond City. Just look for the neon sign with the heart in it. I'll talk to him. Thanks, Piper. I'll talk to him. He'll like you. He's got a soft spot for the hard luck cases. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where this story goes next. Piper. <laughs> no, I'm not actually going to care because the whole of Dime, Diamond City is just going to go after me. You've just leveled up. I know. I know. I've, I don't even know if I've leveled up like all the, I've put on the other perks. I can't remember. Yeah, I've got like five perks to put on. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do. No, 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 you can do underneath. underneath. Go in. Oh. Pig's pocket. I just spent those two bikes and. And also go down to. down. down the last one of perception. Up. The last up. one of perception. Perception, no, no, no. Perception. Okay. The third one. The third one, I mean. On perception. That one? Yeah. With non automatic rifles, which is practically what everything is. What's that? Oh, stick back to me. Well, I don't do more damage. Don't lose. Kill more health. What have you done with the real Riley? Anyway, guys, um, swear, this has been a pretty good video. I hope you enjoyed. Just uh, went to Diamond City and spoke to Piper, and yeah, stole a few things from that building up there. <laughs> Kyle, no! Oh. Okay, show's over. What's over there here? are no sins in Diamond City. Hear me? Just, 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 just folks. Just like it. Just like it. <laughs> There we go. At least someone in this town did more than just um, stand in. I talk. think he's a bit headless. <laughs> okay. Oh, this turned into Skyrim here. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Men and uh, out. Uh, uh, sorry,